Hello friends, uh, this is Enigma. Let me introduce you to Enigma. Enigma is an electromechanical rotor based cipher system uh, invented in 1932 by the Germans and uh, Hitler would have won World War I had it not been for Alan, Alan Turing who decoded this message. Let me tell you how to decode the message now. Uh, we are now going to learn how to encode and decode messages that is at the end of this lesson you will be able to send secret messages to your friends uh, using simple matrix theory about the concept of inverse uh, now uh, suppose you want to send a message we all know this matrix that uh, in general when I take a multiplied with a inverse or is equal to i this is a unit matrix so if i take a inverse into a that is also i so if i have any matrix and a multiplied with m and i multiply this with a inverse uh, i get m so am is the am is the encoded one and M is the decoded one this is the principle we're going to use uh, so imagine now I have all the alphabet here which I have shown let me point it out for you A B C D E F and they are all associated with numbers 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 and so on so we have 26 of them till z and the blank blank is associated with a zero so this is actually a zero it's not a circle it's a zero uh, now imagine we want to send a secret message say Johnson is in danger Johnson is in danger now I take J J comes out to be from here 10 so I put 10 here 10 O 8 8 is H you can check that 8 is H so I've converted this to a matrix taking taking three at a time 10 15 8 14 19 15 and so on and wherever I need space I, I put a zero here zero stands for space so this is a matrix I have now now the same matrix uh, I've converted it to a 3 into 7 matrix by putting those as numbers here the same numbers so this is the same thing now you can choose any invertible matrix so I've chosen this matrix it's a very simple matrix a 1 2 3 1 3 3 1 2 4 now if I send this message directly it can easily be uh, decoded so I want to have an encryption system to uh, decode this at a later stage first to encode this so to encode this the matrix M we multiplied this with a matrix A uh, also remember that our friend whoever is supposed to decode it will have the inverse of this okay it's like a lock and key system you give the key before itself now let's lock this so let's multiply a with m so when I multiply a with m I get a totally new matrix this way now this can go all over the internet absolutely no problem so we are actually decoding the matrix a it's something like this that this matrix M since it can easily be decoded we are multiplying with some unknown matrix A and converting it to AM AM is the encoded matrix now this is this is our AM AM now imagine our friend gets this matrix and uh, they want to decode it so this is the decoding matrix which is already given uh, which is already given so a inverse so they have this key key system now this a inverse is again multiplied with am am is the uh, encoded one so a inverse into a let me show it here so what happens is a into or a inverse into am becomes a inverse a into m now this is i so this is like i into m and if you recollect i is a unit matrix so i into m is m so again this is decoded so this is what we are doing here so m is equal to a inverse into am now when you use matrix multiplication 
you get back the old matrix that is and then you decode it Johnson he is in danger now you try this yourself as an exercise how to decode this message he is now safe so this is the same concept uh, which uh, many banks use because today a lot of sensitive information is sent all over the internet like uh, credit card information bank accounts so the information is uh, encoded and then decoded using simple metrics or sometimes even complicated metrics. I've given a very, very simple example of a 3x3 inverse, but in reality it could be any n cross n metrics and the bank will have the inverse of that. So as you send any message, immediately it gets, uh, the bank immediately encrypts it and uh, that is the encodes it and uh, the bank will have the inverse of that matrix it will multiply with that and assign the uh, assign numbers to alphabet and it can easily decode the passwords credit card information bank accounts all this uh, thank you for watching uh, i hope uh, you are able to send your own messages now to your friends anytime using simple matrix theory